That's right. We're on live. We're going to get this thing done one way or another. What's up to y'all? Hey, what's up, y'all? If y'all had seen the last video, y'all uh, would definitely know exactly what I'm talking about when I talk about uh, blind people wearing sunglasses and, and also people being teased to a certain point. This video was sent to me by a young man by the name of Montreal Reed uh, from the YouTube channel, hashtag the blind leading the blind. And he talks about how he was bullied and almost committed suicide because of the fact that people had teased him because he was uh, totally blind. I want y'all to take a uh, listen and look at this video and just let me know what y'all think about it, man. Bullying and uh, teasing is nothing to play with, believe me. So check out this video by Montreal. I would like to talk about uh, suicide uh, because it's a very serious topic. And um, unfortunately, uh, a, lot of, a lot of people are being taken out by suicide, you know. Um, and that's, that's sad to say, really. Uh, I'm sitting here talking about it today because um, I've actually tried to commit suicide 20 years ago. Almost 20 years ago to the day, I tried to take my own self out. And I tried to do that because I was getting bullied so bad about my vision situation. Um, people didn't understand. You know, my eyes looked funny to people and uh, the way that I moved was different. So I used to get bullied for that as a kid. And, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I would come home and I wouldn't get no support at home. It'd be, the, you know, basically the same thing. Uh, not from my mom because she did the best she could, but from my brothers. Uh, they was a big part of the bullying, but I've accepted it. You know, they've apologized to me. We've, we've grown past that. But, um, like I said, 20 years ago, I, I tried to take my own life because that I didn't feel like anybody understood what I was going through and I couldn't tell nobody what I was going through. Um, <clears throat> for anybody that is going through that, that is having those thoughts, just always remember, man, this is temporary. This is temporary. If, if God bless you this far, he, he wouldn't leave you here for nothing. So this feeling, these emotions that you're having at this particular time, this is just temporary and you will get through this. If, if God bless you to see another day tomorrow, you will get through this. You know, it's not worth taking your own life. Nothing on this earth is worth taking your own life for. And that's just me speaking personally. Um, for people that are going through it, like I say, um, you have to keep a strong head. You have to keep a, a strong mind. And I'm, I'm thankful that I have a strong mind and I have a strong mental, I have a strong uh, personality because um, if I didn't, you know, like I said, I was almost there. Um, if you feel like you can't talk to somebody, if you're in my particular situation, uh, losing your vision because it happens at all ages suicidal thoughts happen at all ages you don't just have to be a kid you don't have to be an older person um, if you are in that situation and you don't have nobody to talk to about your vision I'm here you know uh, you can inbox me um, message me on Facebook if you know anybody that's going through a situation that I can help them with um, speaking from a blind point of view you know, because um, it is serious. It is serious. And uh, sometimes we feel like there's it, nobody out here to understand uh, what we're going through. If you are experiencing any suicidal thoughts, please call the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline number at 1-800-273-8255.